Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. Ford Capscaler. Uh, this will be a short video. I just want to show you one example as to why you should have a short HDMI cable. Okay, I already have it hooked up. Uh, it's Call of Duty right now. What I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to go ahead, unplug it, and plug it back in. And I want you guys to see just how quickly, uh, less than three seconds, it will take for the uh, this cable, this short little white HDMI cable, which I have right here connected to my Xbox One X. It is a high-speed cable, and, and it works really well. And it's it's like less than a feet. Like, it's a very short cable. I think it's like maybe one feet. Very short. And less than a feet, I think. It's a very short cable. But it's a high-quality, very short cable, and you're going to get a much better... Uh, zero latency, uh, higher read of bandwidth, so you will see just how quickly it's going to read the signal once I t uh, unplug it and plug it back in. So let me keep the camera like this. I'm going to unplug it and plug it back in really quick, and I want you guys to see just how quickly it's going to read. So I'm going to unplug it really quick. Hold on. This is kind of hard to do with one hand, so I'm going to keep it like this. Okay, it's unplugged. So now I'm gonna plug it back in, just to show you. Here we go. It's already plugged in. Less than three seconds. Like 2.3, like three seconds. That's how long it took. So it's like 2.1 second, I would say it took. Uh, and that's pretty fast. And you also get a much better readout on the HDMI, you know, like uh, barely any latency, you know, everything runs smoother, better, you know, switching between, you know, the controller. So it's just a, um, you're going to have a much better quality as well because you got a shorter HDMI cable. Now you have a short HDMI cable with a, an instant bandwidth readout of the bit rate, so whatever the bit rate is here, your TV will read it, okay? And on top of that, when you switch between Xbox and other device, this thing will read it much quicker and faster. So let's do it one more time. Let me go ahead and let me unplug it. And I'm gonna plug it back in. So I'm gonna plug it in right now. Here we go. Okay, I plugged in the cable, so let's see how long it's going to take. 2.1 seconds, like 3 seconds, honestly. It took about 3 seconds, and it's, it's much better, much faster. So highly recommend that you use a short cable uh, on all of your devices, even on this device, even on the Oppo. You know, the, the shorter the cable, sh the sh like the shorter high premium quality HDMI 2.0 cable, the better it's going to be. Okay, the longer the cable, then you're gonna have some issues. Uh, there's gonna be some issues because, uh, but one of my main issue with this TV is is the the hub. I'm not a really huge fan of the hub because you can see, it goes from the hub to the TV with another cable. All right, I would prefer if it was like directly built into it, and if. The tuner, HDMI tuners, were built into inside the TV, so that way you can directly connect it. Okay, so short little video. I know that some of you cannot do this because of your setup. You have a receiver, stuff are going through your receiver, so you have no choice. But if you do have a receiver, if you do have a home theater setup, I recommend that you invest into a very good audio quest, 12 feet to 13, 16 feet, uh, high quality gold plated HDMI cable. Okay. So there you have it, short little video. And uh, just came from gym, kind of out of breath. Been doing some, uh, you know, back, lower back, upper, uh, upper back and some lats and some squats, you know, the usual stuff. Anyway. Hopefully, hopefully you guys like this video. Hopefully this is uh, informative and helpful. Uh, if you guys don't believe me, you can do your own research and you will find out the shorter the cable, high quality HDMI shorter cable, it's better 
for the uh, higher bandwidth. So you can, you know, you want you want the best you want to squeeze the best possible picture quality out of your TV, and you're gonna do that with a higher bandwidth readout from your HDMI cable. Okay, because remember, this external device has to communicate with your TV. All right, they gotta communicate, and if they got a, a short cable, lease cable with a very good gold-plated quality, 2.0, then you're gonna have much better picture quality represented here. All right, guys, so there you have it. Thank you for watching.